Hi there everybody and welcome back to ASFC Chemistry. This is a short video where I'll cover the alcohol structural details and some naming of some simple and more complicated structures to help introduce the alcohol functional group that you'll find in module four of the OCRA specification. I personally recommend that you screenshot these slides and keep them as flashcards on your phone. And don't forget that you can click the little I to the top right hand corner of the screen right now to find out other videos on the alcohol functional group. Let's get started. Since alcohols have an oxygen directly bonded to a hydrogen as a part of their structure, they can form hydrogen bonds to water molecules, which means alcohols are soluble in water. Since they have hydrogen bonding as their strongest type of intermolecular bond, we find that alcohols have much higher boiling points than their comparative alkanes. For example, it requires a lot more energy to boil propanol than propane since the intermolecular bonds are stronger. Therefore, propanol has a much higher boiling point. Surrounding the oxygen in the alcohol functional group, we find that there are two bond pairs of electrons and two lone pairs of electrons. As a result, the shape surrounding the oxygen is non-linear and the bond angle, which you should remember from module two, is 104.5 degrees. When we have multiple alcohol groups on a single molecule, we reincorporate the E after the AN in our naming. For example, this is butane 2,3-diol. When an alkene and an alcohol are on the same molecule, we put the N before the OL since we list our suffixes alphabetically. When an alcohol functional group and a carboxylic acid group are on the same molecule, we have ourselves a hydroxy acid molecule. In circumstances such as this, instead of using ol to describe the alcohol's position, we switch to using a prefix of hydroxy, as you can see demonstrated on screen now. I hope you found this video helpful. If you'd like to have a look at the reactions of the alcohol functional group, including explanation of primary, secondary, and tertiary classifications, then click the little link on screen now, or click the I to the top right-hand corner of the screen to find our alcohol online lectures. Until next time, however, happy revising.